Leave a like on the video if you like guava juice. Hey what's up guys and welcome to top 10 videos. Today we are going to be going over 10 guava juice secrets. If you're new to the channel be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and once you've done that go in the comment section comment I subscribed and we will try to respond to every single one of you guys because we truly do appreciate all of you new subscribers. So with further ado let's go over 10 guava juice secrets. Coming up first at number 10, guava juice aka Roy started creating videos in 2005. That is one year before YouTube was created. Once YouTube was created, Roy jumped right onto that grind. It was a place for him to share the videos he has created over the years. He was instantly a vlogger, using an old camera that his family had in the past. His very first his very first channel was called Hoy It's Roy, which is now called Wasabi Productions. Now his channel is called Guava Juice. I'm not sure of where he actually came up with the name Guava Juice, but he is involved to that name, which has been very successful for him to this day. Check out a little animation of his life. Hi, my name is Roy. Today, I'm going to draw my life. Psych! I'm gonna animate my life. Let's get started! So when my mom and dad got married, they, um... Wait, 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 that's way too far. Let's fast forward just a little bit. It was August 21st, 1991, and a new baby was born. His name was Roy. That's me. I was born in the Gupan City, Pangasinan in the Philippines. I was a dark, big-headed baby, and I was cute too. At least my parents said I was. Next up is spot number 9. Before Roy actually started to get into doing those types of videos like do it yourself and other types, he actually was a gaming channel where he played games and he even played some games that had scary pop outs. Sort of like how PewDiePie grew, he did scary video games. But here if you want to see some kind of games that he used to play, check out this clip. By the way this is from a couple years ago and it's pretty creepy. I need batteries now! YouTube, welcome to Guava Juice. Today we're playing Boogeyman again. Freaking scary game. I died like twice last episode. But if you're new to this game, we're basically trying to survive the night. Similar to Five Nights at Freddy's, survive each night. And we are currently at night number six. So... I don't know about you, but I don't prefer to get scared out in the actual world, but playing scary games or watching scary movies is what I love to do. It just gives you that thrill and excitement, get your blood pumping. But you know that nothing will actually happen because it's just a game or a movie, so it's not as scary, but it still gives you the creeps. Next up, coming at spot number 8, Guava Juice is one of the more successful YouTubers. He's making anywhere from $500,000 to $1 million a month. That is a ton of money. That means that he is making just at least $10 million a year. Something that is crazy is that one of his videos on Wasabi Productions, before he split ways on the channel, a video hit over 100 million views. Just take that in. 100 million views. That's a ton of views. It's a pretty funny video actually. I'll give you a little sneak peek. Dancing before you know it. You'll be falling for me, baby! Hi, my name's Rolanda. You're such a hottie. Can I kiss you? I want your body. Ew, you're so ugly. Gross and smelly. Can I kiss you? I want your body. Why you no like me? I so pretty. Can I kiss you? I want your body. Ew, your face is crooked. I don't know about you guys, but after I watched that, I had a smile on my face the entire time. That's literally what Guava Juice does, though. He puts smiles on everyone's faces. That is why he's so successful. Everyone who watches videos loves him for who he is. If he made Barbie videos, people would still watch him. If he made crazy dirt bike stunt videos, people would watch him still. It's just because his personality is perfect, and how could you not want to watch someone as nice as he is? Next at number 7, Guava Juice aka Roy ended up meeting Alex who runs a Wasabi channel in middle school. Roy was the one who talked to Alex asking him if he wanted to do this channel with him. As you can tell, Alex obviously said yes. I bet you that he is for sure grateful and happy that he did, because now he's making tons of money and he's a very successful YouTuber. I bet you they both had no clue they would make such a successful YouTube channel, but they are sure glad that they started it. How's up? Hey. Remember a long time ago when I said I wanted to make a gaming channel? Yeah. I think it's time. <sighs> you sure you want to do this? Yeah, I thought about it for a long time now and I think it's time. Can you promise me something though? That is a long time to be doing work together. As I said in the video, they have been together for 10 years. But they are for sure still friends, obviously. And now Alex is running the Wasabi Productions channel and Guava moved on to his other channel that he wanted to do. That was gaming. As I said earlier, 
though now he has refrained from gaming and gone on to do-it-yourself videos. Guava Juice and Guava Juice 2 are the same people, obviously. Roy runs both the channels, but something that is crazy about the two channels is that both of the channels actually hit 1 million subscribers on the exact same day. Now they are both way apart. Guava Juice has like 4 million subscribers and Guava Juice 2 has like 1.5 million subs, which is super crazy, but he deserves it 100%. His content is amazing. And there you have it. 1 million subscribers for the vlogging channel. Oh my gosh, it's key. It's going still. One more sub. Oh yeah. So we just hit 1 million subscribers on the gaming channel and 1 million subscribers on the vlogging channel. I know I don't post much there, but for that to happen at the same time, it's just like I could not have planned that. Like it was just perfect. And that does not happen regularly. So before I start this, he is so thankful and so glad for everything. That is what I love about him. He doesn't take advantage of anything. This is his habitat and he deserves what he has. Next at number five, Guava Juice tweeted out saying that Guava Juice 2 will be coming in 2017. So what that means is that he is going to be going and uploading on his second channel more often. And guess what? It's 2017. So that channel is going to be booming soon. So that is so awesome. And now we can get double the Guava Juice, which is awesome. Coming in at spot number four, Guava Juice's most popular series on his channel is his bath challenge. Almost all of his bath challenge videos are breaking over 5 million views, which is crazy. I'm surprised he doesn't do more of these videos because those amount of views are crazy. And the videos are very high quality and actually super enjoyable. Well, at least I enjoy watching them. They have humor to them and they're actually pretty cool. This is the slime bath challenge. Oh, it's so sticky. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh look at that engulfing me. Is this healthy for your skin? Oh, look at all this slime. Oh my goodness. This is insane. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 merrily. This bathtub is really green. Don't you guys agree? That was so cool. The part I didn't show you was he actually shows you step by step how to create the slime before he does it. So you have to go check that out for yourself. Now coming at spot number three. When Guava Juice did decide to leave Wasabi, people sent a ton of hate to him saying that he wouldn't be successful and that he would never make it to the place he is today. But that just drove him to work harder and harder, and that led him to gain over 4 million subscribers in one year. That is definitely one way to prove the haters wrong. And he wanted this pretty bad, obviously, or else why would he have left Wasabi to go on to do a gaming channel? Like I said before, he deserves this. He truly deserves every bit of this. When I left Wasabi, um, it, it was very discouraging. Like. When I left Wasabi to start this channel, I got a lot of hate, like, a lot of hate. Like, people told me I sucked, or to die, or to stop what I was doing, or go back to Wasabi because I can't do anything else. I wasn't capable of doing anything else, and I don't think they understood, like... Next up is spot number two. Guava Juice's brother is actually the one who filmed all of Guava Juice's videos. So the guy who works that magic behind the camera is actually Roy's brother. That is something I had no clue, which is actually so cool. It's sort of a family-run business, which is awesome. Finally, coming at spot number one, the YouTuber named Marlin is actually Guava Juice's cousin, and Roy is who inspired him to start his YouTube channel. He is breaking over 1.3 million subscribers, which is fantastic for him. Roy and Marlin have collabed multiple times. If you want to see one of the videos just from the other day, stay tuned. Here we go, it's a go, go. What is up, my beautiful Marmars? And today, I'm here with my cousin. I was wondering, hmm, what happens when you take two 1,000 degree samurai swords and touch them together. Will they cut through? What's gonna happen? I don't know, that's what we're gonna find out. Okay, let's go. What we do? <laughs> All right, our swords are super red and super hot right now. I hope you guys enjoyed that clip and the overall video. Let me down below if I tell you any new facts about Guava Juice or if you're a hardcore fan and you already knew all the facts that I just told you. But that's going to wrap up the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.